Howdy, howdy, everyone. How are you guys doing tonight? Friday, Friday. Wow, November 11th, huh? Um, actually, I got up today. I thought it was Saturday for a few minutes there. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. No, it's not. Oh, I took that out of the room, too. Well, Ag nab it. Um, Michaela was just looking this up for me. I don't know what it is. It's, here's the, look at the thing, B-A-N-D-O-L-I-E-R. Uh, I don't know anything about it, but it's a cute little, um, like, wristlet thing, but then it also has a phone case. I don't know what it fits, but Michaela said they were like maybe a hundred dollars or something. I don't know if any of you guys want to look it up. I'll do more research on it. I just didn't have time. Like here was another one. Um, I've never heard of this brand before, so we'll look her up later. Are you little rascal. So hello, hello to everyone. So, oh, hi, Susan. We had a long day. Yeah, I've been running around all day. Thank you so much, Dawn, for posting all of that info. Appreciate ya. And I see Cindy and Maria and Roberta Phillips. Hello, ladies. Um, CC, hi, CC. Um, Liz, hello, Liz. Welcome back. Rebecca, I see you and I see Candy Corn. Candy corn in the house, and there's Shirley. Hi, Shirley. Who else is in here? There's Eddie. Um, is Eddie going to behave tonight? Is Eddie, you're going to behave tonight? Um, who else? Oh, <laughs> extra dolled up for him. <laughs> Eddie, you're pretty funny. Um, hello, frugal granny. Good to see you. Oh, <laughs> red lipstick. Oh, here we go. Hello, Brookie. Welcome in, everyone. Yes, I sure did, Rebecca. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. Hi, Roberta Scott. Hi, Roberta. You guys, I shipped out so many packages. It had to have been over 200 pounds. I actually posted a short video so you guys could see. Um, so... And with that said, let me check something real quick here. Okay. Um, and hold on. Winnie, don't start. I actually going to have to set my alarm for this real quick. Um, so besides that, you guys got anything planned for the weekend? Anything good? Uh, we won't be there. Won't be an auction tomorrow, <clears throat> but there will be one on Sunday. And seven oh five eight. Let's see. One hour. Um. Okay. Yeah, anything planned? I am going to be doing housework tomorrow. Much, much needed housework. Hi, Patrick. Great to see ya. Um, and Addicted. Hi, Addicted. Welcome back. Good to see you. Um, Betsy. Hi, Betsy. And... Uh, Oh, Susan, good. I'm, cool. I'm glad it arrived. I'm glad it arrived there. Um, yeah, right, Janet? <laughs> it is, is, was crazy. It's a lot of hours of work shipping packages, you guys. Like, it's a lot, lot of work. And yeah, I mean, it's part of, part of the gig. So it's no complaining, but I'm um, just letting you guys know it's, it is a substantial amount. Hi, Jazzies. Welcome back in. Yep, Roberta has been painting some new uh, items for you guys. So hopefully she'll have a box um, coming out. <laughs> Eddie, Eddie, Eddie. 
Um, yeah, and uh, guys, please hit that smash button, or if you like to share it out, that would be great. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, did you get, yes, uh, Roberta, thank you. Yep, I sure did. So I am going to, uh, be shipping your package. I'm going to try and get to the post office tomorrow before they close. <laughs> Susan's like, uh, wait a minute. I think she's looking at all of us. <laughs> oh, I have some really cute stuff. Oh, sit down, buddy. Um, really cute stuff today, you guys. Uh, we got some new bags. Um, got some really cool coach and Michael Kors and two Kate Spades. One's like a briefcase style. Um, I've got some, let's see here. I've got some Ray Dunn, some new little ones. Autumn, Autumn, babe. That's so cute. Um, what else? Michaela has a really beautiful leather fossil bag. And then this is a stunning Dooney and Burke right here. I think it's maybe black, maybe black, something like that. Um, got some other cute stuff. I've actually got some of those women's socks we sold last week. I've got um, men's ones too. Really nice. You should see inside. So I have a couple men's items. And then you guys, so you know, I've been bringing you these. These are uh, not frosted flakes, but they are uh, lounge pants. Now um, I went online. I searched. I even went to the website and searched. They don't even have these. I can't find them for sale anywhere. I, uh, and I, I did spend about five minutes looking around, but again, I did go to their website and they don't even have them for sale on their website yet. But, uh, and these are extra large, extra large fits 35 to 47 inches. 35 to 47 inches. Oh, wait till you guys see this. Look what I have. It's a Ray Dunn blanket. And it says, happy fall, y'all. Happy fall, y'all. Yeah, got this uh, awesome blanket. So that's going to be up for, for bid here later. Um, when I do ship it, it's not going to be in this uh, cardboard that's in there. Because obviously... That's going to take up a lot of room, so I will take it out of that. First, I've got um, some cute, look at these for the Coca-Cola lovers. Look at the boxers. So cute. The, the Coca-Cola lover will love those. This is a size large, and I do have an extra large. Large fits 36, 38, extra large 40 to 42 inches. So we're going to have those coming up. Um, oh, so I had a big score at uh, World Market and scored these uh, baklava walnut with oat flakes and vanilla flavoring. And they are individually packaged in here. Um, so I'm going to be sending every one um, in your purchases tonight. So you'll get, they're individually wrapped. Michaela and I tried it and I was actually pretty impressed. I'm not a huge baklava um, lover, but I wasn't uh, disappointed in this one at all. So yeah, I scored a bunch of boxes of those. So everyone's going to get a free one. Uh, free. Thank you, Roberta. Appreciate that. Um, oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, Roberta Scott like that. So, all right. Um, should we get started? Should we get this party started? I did get, get some cute squishmallows, too. <laughs> That one up there, the stitch one, the little blue guy. I've got this big one, uh, tie-dye octopus. And then I've got two um, little ones. And then I also got some little mini ones too. I can't believe how expensive even these little ones were online. But I've got little baby ones. 
Like this one was going for 10 bucks online. I'm not going to sell it for that. I'll sell it for lower or cheaper. So you guys get a, a good deal here. Um, Sunday's auction, we are going to have some lots of items um, available. So be sure to be here on Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Um, all right, 23 people. Where's everybody at? I even uh, started a little bit later to give people um, time to finish making dinner and stuff. And whatnot. And all right, maybe we'll, I have a couple of Vera Bradley. Maybe we'll start with that until we can um, get more folks in here. Um, let's start with this one. Again, this is Vera, if you didn't know. <laughs> pocket and a, a slip pocket and a zipper compart uh, pocket. Inside um, is six slip pockets, three on each side. And let's do an auction and uh, style. And we're going to look for opening bid of, let's do opening bid of $10. It's pretty nice, uh, nice size too. Oh, Winnie. Oh, really? Oh, son of a gun. Um, it's 14, 14 by 13. And I think it's pretty fall colors. Really good condition. I'm not seeing any rips, tears, stains. Overall, pretty good. Okay. Any interest? Make sure I did send out the email. Um, okay. All right, there is Cindy. Thank you, Cindy. Hi, Valerie. Good to see you. Okay, um, oh, boss is, he is laying right here in my lap. Um, we already started his little whining, but then Michaela came up and sat with him and he stopped. All right, if there is no one for 12, then I'm going to go ahead and call it to Cindy. Okay, sold to you, Cindy. Thank you so much. All right. I got some, um, well, actually, I think I only have one thing of coffee today, but I've got, um, I didn't even know Ray Dunn did coffee, but check it out. Uh, let's take Cindy's bit off the screen. Um, morning pumpkin, Ray Dunn pumpkin spice medium roast ground coffee. It's a 12 ounce bag. Did you guys know? I didn't know uh, that Ray Dunn, when he sit still, buddy. Um, so let's start with an opening bid of $8. $8 Radon Pumpkin Spice. And it's ground, did I say that? Medium roast ground coffee. And you can smell it. It's still, it's sealed, but it smells yummy. All right, Jedit is at eight. Thank you so much, Jedit.
Okay, if there is no one for 10, then we'll call it sold. So last, last call. All right, I don't see any other interest. So let's call it sold to you, Jedit. Thank you so much. All right, Winnie, this is going to get real complicated, honey. So go get in your bed, okay? So let's see here. Yeah, and again, don't be shy. If you see something behind me that you would like to see, don't be shy. Um, we will put it up sooner. Okay, so I have this little baby Squishmallow. I did look these all up online and it's a little piggy. Let's see about how big he is. Um, and he was going for $10 online. I, again, I don't, um, I haven't really got into Squishmallows. I've just been buying some of these and then look up the value online. But yeah, I didn't realize um, some of these, I guess to be expected, it's kind of like the Beanie Baby craze. But um, I'm not going to sell this to you guys for 10 bucks. That's just insane. Insane price for this. But um, I will start them at, let's start them at an opening bid of $4. Four bucks for the little piggy Squishmallow. It has this little Squishmallow tag there. And again, this would be super cute little um, little stocking stuffers or to put on top of the present and Roberta Scott is in at four do we have anyone for six and if not then I'm gonna call it sold Okay. Okay, let's call it to you, Roberta. Scott, thank you so much. I the next one that I have is um it's a little uh, where did you just go? It just rolled away. Um where did you just go? Oh, there it is. Okay. It rolled away. It rolled away. Uh, the next one I have is a little peach. It's a little peach squishmallow. And oh, there's this little tag. And this little guy was online for $12. 12 bucks. Uh, so we're going to start at five, looking for opening bid of $5 for the cute little peach. I know, it's just darling. Okay, any... Oh, yeah, Roberta, yeah, they're um, crazy. I mean, you see these little things everywhere. Everywhere I go, they're like in every store. Oh, my gosh, Roberta, that is so funny. You guys, uh, if there's no other interest, I'll call it sold to Roberta. Um, they're on TikTok. Roberta, did you send it to me or Dawn? I don't remember. But um, so teenagers, I'm going to say, um, are taking the Squishmallow, a stuffing out of it, and they're using the material to make 
a shirt or a tube top. <laughs> the girl had the video where she had her squishmallow and she was like, and then the screen changed and she was wearing it. It was so hilarious. <laughs> and Roberta said, yeah, this one's too small to make a top. It's too small for even Winston. Okay, Roberta. Congratulations. Um, oh, yes. Oh, if Momo was still here, we could make him a little shirt out of this. <laughs> it's a Georgia peach. Okay. okay, the next little one. This one's really cute. I, I have never seen any of these, so I don't know. It's all new to me. But look at it is a flying dog maybe and it has a little penguin i think it's a penguin and see it fits in there so you can put them in there but um it has its tag holding it together um this was online for 15 dollars, 15 bucks so i am gonna do an opening bid of eight dollars on this one eight dollars and you're gonna get both of them the, the flying penguin. Let me see if I can get it in there. There we go. Oh, <laughs> and just so you can see about the size of it. <laughs> He's like, Aah. okay, Roberta Scott with an opening bid of eight. Thank you so much. And then Liz is coming back at 10. Thank you so much for your bids, guys. Do we have anyone for 12 before I call it? <laughs> A Momo airplane. Momo was uh, Michaela's hamster uh, that we had for a few years. Passed away a couple years ago. And it was complete... Oh, it's just the most tragic thing. Um, but yeah, we could have put Momo in here. All right. If uh looks like no other interest, so let's go ahead and call it um to Liz. Thank you, Liz. Put your name on it. Okay, I have one more small one, so let's just knock it out. Let's just knock it out, and then uh, we'll move on. Okay, so this next one was going for ten dollars online, and it uh, it looks like a little a little octopus. He's adorable. So let's go ahead and start with an opening bid of $4. He's a really cute little, um, like a mint green, mint green color. Yeah, <laughs> there's having fun. <laughs> oh, okay. CC, CC's coming in at four. Anyone for six? Oh, and I do have a couple uh, cute um, Starbucks uh, tumblers, too. Really cute one has, like, little peppermints all over it. You can see it right there. All right. Let's call it to CC, then. Thank you so much, CC.
All right. Moving right along. Um, uh, this is really darling, you guys. This is um, the little sleep mask, and uh, it's a llama. Just a darling. Look at that dreamy llama eye mask. And we're going to look. It's uh, for an oh, starting bid of ten dollars. He is like so. He looks like it's so soft and cozy. Any anyone? Great little gift here for someone. All right, Cindy at 10. Thank you so much. Do we have anyone for 12? Okay, last call. If no other interest, then we'll call it sold to Cindy. All right. Thank you so much, Cindy. Oh, it's for you. Is it going to fit you? <laughs> it's going to fit her. Okay, so that's Cindy's box. Um, I got some. This is really cute, you guys. Look at this. So it is ceramic. Um take that off and look at you had me at pumpkin spice um has the let me take this tape off so you guys can see the, the lid so it has you know the uh thing here just you just uh turn it to get the mouth part um but yeah, really nice. Uh, not sure. Let's see if there's um, an ounces on this. I don't think there is. But it is six and a half inches tall. And we're going to do an opening bid of opening bid of $12 on this one, you guys. Brand new. You had me at Pumpkin Spice. Again, it is ceramic. There is your lid, and it just slides back and forth. I'm going to back this light up because it's putting a glare on the items. Let's see. Let's see if that helps. Okay, any still is kind of a glare there. Okay. If there is no interest, we can bring it back later. Okay, I've got Jetted at 12. Thank you so much, Jetted. If there's no one for 14, then I'll just call it to jet it. Thanks so much. Appreciate your guys' bids. Thank you. Um, well, I might as well just do the other one. Here's the other. And this one has just a little acorns and leaves. Again, this is ceramic, six and a half inches tall. Um, your little uh, lid there for your hot or cold drinks. And we're going to look for opening bid of 12. I love my uh, 
my, I have a few different, you know, tumblers that I take when I leave the house. And I just love my tumblers. Um, let's see. Oh, that's so sweet. Jetta, you're the sweetest. Send to Donnie Dawn. And actually, I've got a box of Dawn stuff right here. So let's make sure I put it with her stuff. All right. Roberta Scott at 12. Thank you so much. Yeah, we have the such an awesome group here. You guys are the best. Um, all right. If there is no one for 14, then we'll call it. That's so nice of you. All right. We're going to call that one sold to Roberta. Scott, thanks so much. Um, I have this. This one is another uh, Michaela's Finds. And um, this is a, another Vera. Just a little uh, tote bag, overnight bag, travel bag, whatever you want to use it for. Um, let's do an opening bid, opening bid of $8 on this one. Nice size too. You can probably uh, fit Cindy Warner in this bag. Little Cindy. <clears throat> I like that kind of blue denim kind of look. Okay. All right. And if there's no interest, we can bring it back out later. Um, or if, again, if someone comes in, those of you who might be new, um, if you come in and we passed on something just um, and you're interested, just let us know in the chat. We can bring it back out or always uh, just feel free to send me send me an email. Um, yeah, and that's a good idea, too. Yeah, Roberta. Um, <laughs> yes, yeah, Cindy could fit in here. <laughs> Hi, Linda. Welcome in. In. Um, let's see, what should we do next? There's so much, so much cute stuff. Do you guys want to look at this? I thought this was just absolutely adorable. Um, it is wood. You can see about the size of it there. And the little um, self-explanatory. And the nice thing with these are... They are attached by a string, so they're not falling and getting lost. Okay, Linda, I'll put you down for it. I'll put you down for that. And it's just darling. I know it's not. Let's do it this way. There we go. No. <laughs> I'll just, I'm leaving it alone. So um, let's do an opening bid of $10 on this. And it is brand new. Countdown to Christmas. Okay, let's put Linda down for that. Let me put Linda's name on this bag so I don't try reselling it. <laughs> I'm 
All right. I see your guys' bids coming in. Um, Valerie was at 10. And then Liz is at 12. Valerie, 14. Um, just let me give you a quick measurement. It is eight and a half inches long and uh, five inches tall. Hey, Renee. Okay, um, Liz is coming back at 16. And Valerie at 18. Um, oh, that is crazy. Your brother is 6'4", and you're five. Wow. <laughs> How does that happen? Okay, Liz is out. Thank you so much, Liz, for letting us know that you're out. And then we'll go ahead and call it sold to our friend, Valerie. Okay, thank you so much. Um, I have these, you guys, um, found these and there's one missing, but maybe there's someone that only needs four of them. Um, I love these. They are a silver tone um, color, but yeah, there's one missing. So you're going to get five of them and I am going to start with an opening bid of $8. Eight bucks and, you know, maybe if you have a nightstand or something, you just need one, uh, um, one for each one or uh, maybe a dress or something. You just need four of them. Hi, Frugal Granny. Did I say hi yet? Um, oh, I know. Gosh, I couldn't even attempt that, Roberta. <laughs> wouldn't be able to attempt that yeah and these are so beautiful in person like they it's just very like victorian antique looking the dogs are doing awesome renee thank you for asking okay if there is no one for 10 then I'm going to go ahead and call it to Liz. Okay. Congratulations to Liz. Thanks so much. I think this is your first item tonight, right? Oh, no. You got the... Oh, yeah. Here's your box. Perfect. Okay. Um, and again, for those of you guys who are coming in, we are um, the free gift tonight with your purchase. Um, I scored these baklavas, walnut, vanilla, um, and everyone will be getting um, an individual uh, one of them individually wrapped package. Um, depending on how many sales there are tonight, if there's enough to give a couple, I'll put more in your box for you guys. Hi, Phyllis. Um, what else do you guys want to see? Um, look at how adorable you guys. Autumn babe. Autumn babe Ray Dunn. Uh, let's start with an opening bid of ten dollars. Love the fall colors. And so I I've been spying and I saw some of the Ray Dunn Christmas ones. And there is uh, one with Santa's legs coming out like he's going down the chimney. And uh, there was a snowman one. So I am going to be 
trying to score some deals on those. All right, CC is in at 10. Anyone at 12, otherwise I'll call it sold. Yeah, and CC, your box went out by FedEx uh, during the week, um, and I delicately wrapped your mugs. So um, I took it to FedEx, and the guy now is getting, uh, I'm familiar now because I'm there a lot, but I said, you take care of this box. Do you hear me now? Or else you will be hearing from me. All right, let's call it to CC. Oh, really? Walmart is? God, you guys, I am going to tell you, I don't go into Walmart um, at all, uh, but I do do my, um, I do my grocery shopping online and I just pick up the groceries, you know? So God, do you, any of you guys do that? Um, do your, order your groceries online and then go and, uh, pick them up. They do the grocery shopping for you. It's, it's like the best thing ever. I'm so, so happy. Um, let's see who's, what's this? this is CC's box. Yeah, but, oh, that's, but that's cool. I'll have to check them out. Um, what else do you guys want to do? Is anyone looking at any handbags? Um, Oh, yeah, Walmart pickup. Love that. Now, I live across the street from a King Super, and I think I've just been more lazy of signing up. I'm just, I love that Walmart, when you go to reorder your groceries, it has everything you've purchased, so you can just quickly add those items. And, oh, it's, I just got to stop being lazy and just sign up. Um... What do you guys want to see? Um, real quick, I haven't shown this in a while. Um, but oh, stop, don't, don't, don't go that way. Don't go that way. Okay, be nice. Um, I haven't shown these in a little bit, but I was cleaning out the other room and I still, I think, like have maybe five or six left of these. Um, so this is a company called Wicked Vanity Beauty. And it's going to come in this nice box. Um, even has a little card thing here. Hand cast, buffed, and painted. Um, it, it, it looks like crystals, but um, it's for your makeup brush holders. Or you can use it for pens and pencils on your desk, whatever you want to do. But it is more uh, made for beauty. Um, so here are some makeup brushes. These are a little shorter. But what a great gift, you guys, to give to, uh, to someone. Uh, Michaela and I both have one on our little vanities, and it just is such a cool-looking piece. Um, these are a buy it now of $20. So if you are interested, um, just type 20. And again, I'm pretty sure that I have about five of these left. Yeah, really, really cool. Has that um, real, uh, what is it, iridescent -y when the light hits it. All right, we've got Roberta Scott. <laughs> There's Renee. She calls it the, the Superman Glass Fortress. Okay, Roberta Scott. Thank you so much. And then I've got Liz. Perfect. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, you guys won't be disappointed there. Um, it's a pretty cool little thing. Um, I have, I just think this is the coolest. I so, we sold one of these. I, I don't remember who got it. it Might have been CC, but um, it's a vintage, it looks like a little pill case. But when you open it up, it's a mini sewing kit. It has, look at that little thread. It has um, some safety pins in here. 
Um, but we're going to start with an opening bid of $10. Let's see how big that is there. It's like a kind of gold, it's a gold tone and the, the little uh, pattern has blue and gold. Okay. If there is no interest, we can bring it back out later. And then I do have a little uh, vintage pill box. I've got these cute little flowers. And then when you open it up, you have the little divider there for your pills. And we're going to do opening bit of 10. Okay, Roberta, you're going to take the uh, sewing one. Okay. Thank you so much, Roberta. Okay, that one's Birdie Birds. And then I've got CC um, with an opening bit of 10. Do we have anyone for 12? Um, otherwise, we'll end it there. Hi, Joanne. How are you? Good to see. Oh, it is so cold here, Renee. You guys, it has been. Oh, and Rebecca's coming back at 12. It has been so stinking cold. And that is where, if you guys remember, um, um, oh, last year I scored from Bed Bath & Beyond um, the, uh, the heated mattress pad. And it was king size, thank goodness. It is the coolest creation ever on this planet. I love, love, love um, having my heated mattress pad. I can just turn it on at night. Um, Rebecca. Okay. Yeah, that it is. Let me tell you, if that thing ever stops working, I am immediately going and getting a new one because I can't live without that thing now. Because um, I don't have to turn the heat on during the night. I just put on my heated mattress pad and it keeps me warm all night. Okay, so that one is going to Rebecca. Thank you so much, Rebecca. Okay. Um, I've got these cool socks. We had some of these last week. Um, these are heat retainer women's socks. It says this fits a size six to 11, high density yarn, soft brushed lining, all day comfort. Looking for an opening bit of 10. Yeah, and as cool, Cindy, is that um, it has its own little controller um, on each side of the bed, so. When Champ sleeps on one side, he can adjust his temperature, and then I can adjust on my side. <laughs> oh, yep. Champy, Champy sleeps on the other side. All right. Oh, Heather, you want to pay for Roberta's. Oh, are you talking about the pill box? Um, the little pill box uh, sewing kit? Is that what you're referring to? That's so sweet of you guys. All right, Jed, it's at 10. Is there anyone for 12 before I call it sold? Okay, then let's go into you, Jed. Thank you so much. Make sure I think that 
Oh, oh, thanks, Roberta. Oh, I'm sorry I missed that. Perfect. I marked it. Here it is. Um, so check out these, you guys. I love it. Um, this will be really nice, you know, if you have guests over um, and you guys, they want to maybe take a, a drink home, coffee home, or just use these. Uh, these are Ray Dunn, um, Ray Dunn pumpkin spice coffee cup set. You're going to get eight cups with uh, eight lids. Plus, you're going to get the cute little sleeves um, to protect your little um, hands from getting too hot. Uh, and we're going to do an opening bid of $10 on this. And again, you're going to get eight of them. The, uh, the sleeves, the cups, and the lids. Do, do. And it's 16 ounce. That would... Okay. If there's no interest. We can bring it back out later. Yeah, because I um, well, I had not uh, these, but I had found some uh, ones a while back from Party City. Um, not Ray Dunn, but, oh, I love it. Um, I keep them in my cabinet and take some of those on the go sometimes. If I, if my tumbler hasn't been cleaned, <laughs> then I go reach for one of these. Um, all right, Joanne, let's just call it sold to her. Thank you so much, Joanne. She needs butt warmers. Put that heated mattress pad. It'll keep your tuchus warm. That's for sure. Okay. I'm going to put Joanne's name in this box. All right. Um, let me show you guys... I don't know if it's too early to do um, handbags yet, but I'm going to show it to you guys nonetheless. Um, look at this beautiful Michael Kors. Has that cool locket style. Awesome condition. Very, very good condition. Um, you have the long strap, or you can do the handles. And you can see about how big it is there. And inside, got these little fluffers. Um, inside the lining looks like it needs to be cleaned up a little bit. I, I tr I'm going to try and clean it. Uh, I just pull the liner out like this, and then I clean it all up and let it dry. But it has lots of space. It has uh, two slip pockets. And it has a zipper compartment with some more slip pockets. But other um, than inside needs to be just a little tidied up. Uh, the outside is fantastic. Uh, you guys, these bags are going online for $100 to $125. I could not find this bag for any cheaper. Um, there, if, if you do look online... They do have some of these, but they're the sh uh, smaller one. They're not as tall. So this is the tall. This is the tall one. Um, so, and if anybody wants it, I'm telling you, if if it's 100 and 125 online, I would do it right now for a buy it now of 65. If someone wants to steal this bag from me for 65 bucks. Oh, and it has the, the you know. Louis Vuitton did that with the little key uh, for the locket. <laughs> but yeah, great, great bag. 
and you can score a great deal here. You're not going to find this tall bag um, for that price online. But yeah, and if someone watches on replay, you just message me if you are interested. I've got this cute little black coach. Let's see. Um, inside, it does have a little zipper compartment. Just a cute little darling purse. Um, if someone wants to take this one for a buy it now, I'll do a buy it now of $22. And it's in fantastic shape. Handles are perfect. Not seeing any even wear or anything on the outside of the bag. I know there's a few few people that like the little bags. I think I think Rosita might be one. Someone else told me last time they like their little bags. Um, yeah, still have this one. Love this Michael Kors, kind of baby pink colored. Looks to be brand new. Um, they were selling for over a hundred dollars online. Uh, but I think we put it up on Poshmark for maybe, maybe 65. Um, oh yeah, I can show that right next if you like, Susan. But yeah, this is gorgeous. And you can take this off and just uh, use it as like a, a wallet if you want, or like a clutch. Lots of compartments. And see, it snaps off here to take off the strap. Um, but it's in perfect condition. Again, I'm pretty sure it's brand new. We have it listed on Poshmark for 65 bucks, which is unbelievable considering they're selling for way over 100 online. Um, but I would lower it to 50 bucks if anyone is interested. So if you you like it, has a little pocket on the back too. Actually matches my top today. So isn't that darling? It doesn't sell. I'm probably gonna. It's probably gonna end up in my closet. Um, okay, so the Dooney and Burke. Um, I have a couple, but I think you've seen those ones. So, this is Michaela's bag. <laughs> she scored this. She we um she scored this box. It's been in the other room for few weeks and we kind of forgot about it and she went in there tonight and she's like are these yours or mine I'm like I think they're yours and I'm like wait a minute you have a whole Dooney and Burke in here what are you doing <laughs> so uh she looked them up um I'll give you some more information you have the adjustable long uh detachable uh strap or you can do the handles it's in fantastic condition I mean, this outside of the bag, and look at all of this leather and the straps are stunning. Inside, very, very clean uh, zip compartment, uh, slip pockets. Um, this bag was going for $115 and up online, and Michaela. Um, she said we can do an auction style on this one. You have the zipper closure too. Has a little uh, key attachment. Um, we are going to do an auction style on this one, and we're going to look for an opening bid of one hundred. Which, for you Dooney lovers, you know that that is a stinking amazing deal. Great deal on that bag. Black in color. The handles, look at them. It's like no wear, no damage, nothing on that. 
beautiful bag. I'm like, I don't know how we didn't notice this box of purses in the other. Thank you so much, Cece. Appreciate you. Um, if there is no one for um, 110 um, bid, then we'll call it sold to Cece. Oh, uh, thanks, Roberta. Thank you, Susan. Yeah, I'm going to tell you, I have been super impressed with, with Michaela and uh, her learning about bags and uh, getting an eye for, for picking out some fun bags uh, for you guys. All right, let's call it to Cece. Thank you so much, Cece. Appreciate you. I don't know if Michaela's watching. All right, let's put this in Cece's box. Um, do you guys want to? So this big giant one, I I wrote it down here. Let's see what I wrote. This is the tie dye octopus. Um, you had very good restraint, Susan. I'm very proud of you. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Susan. Um, so the tie-dye octopus, do you know that this sucker is, um, uh, what is the, sought after? I don't know. It's going between $50 and $75. $50 and $75 for this big one. I won't sell it to you for that. Um, oh, thank you, Roberta. Yep. Uh, that is Michaela. That's some of our quality time we spend together looking up items. Um, are you looking at the red one? You can let me know. The red one is a fossil bag. And then there is the peacock green Dooney and Burke right there. Um, so again, the cheapest I could find this big guy for was 50 bucks. I'm going to do a uh, buy it now of $30 if someone wants it. Yeah, if you want to flip it and put it online and sell it for, you know, whatever, I don't care. I'll just want to give you guys a good deal. Yeah, it's a fossil, uh, fossil bag. I'll show you guys that one too. Yeah, there were some other ones, but their eyes were open. With the eyes shut one, those were going for, for a little more money. Um, so yes. Yeah, I, I want to find one that uh, is like a black and white squishmallow that looks like Michaela's old hamster. Would look like Momo. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys this one. The only thing is, you know, it's broken in. It's, uh, it's been gently loved has a pocket here. The only thing I'm seeing is it does have like this little scratch mark right there. And that's why we're going to lower it. This was Michaela's find. Um, you know, it has like just broken in, broken in bag, but it's big. So it has slip pockets on each side and then look inside lots. It's kind of like a briefcase style work bag. Um, it does have the real soft protector. So if you put, you know, an iPad or a laptop in there, um, here is the fossil patch. And so you have this whole compartment with the zipper pocket. Then you have this whole compartment with all those little netting pockets. And then like little slip pockets all the way around here, ID holder. Um, let's see what Michaela wrote. I think she was looking for 35 on this bag. 35, that's a great deal on a on these fossils. Hi, Kristen. Um, oh, and the peacock green one is a Dooney and Burke. So I can show you guys that one too. But yeah, again, if anyone likes anything that was passed on, don't be shy in the chat. 
Don't be shy. Let's turn this way. Okay, so this Dooney and Burke is some very rare. Um, okay, Liz, thank you. I'll put you down for that. Um, so for those of you, you know, we've had a, a few conversations here in, um, in the chat about this bag and we cannot find this green one. I don't know if it's, it's vintage for sure. It's a vintage Dooney, um, but we were only able to find the red one. One of the red ones was on some one of those, uh, I don't know what kind of website it was, but, um, they didn't even have a price listed, but it was sold. Another one that we found was in the high, um, it was almost around close to $200. But this one is a very rare because you can't find the green one. Um, but Michaela was just wanting, uh, this is Michaela's, Michaela's bag. Um, she was asking $100, buy it now. Um, again, probably sell it online for maybe even $200 because you can't find this green one. And it's in great condition. A very different, kind of has like the little peacock design. Yeah, it's a different, uh, a different one. I, I just, um, I just wanted to find a green one for sale. I just wanted to find it so we could get an, uh, just get a better value idea on it. The red one was pretty too, but I think the green one's cooler. I think it's cooler. Okay, let's put Liz's name on this one. Hi, Amy. Oh, uh, Liz just bought the red fossil. Let's... Let's put Liz's name on it. Don't even know if we have any other red stuff, but um, I do have the little stitch. Oh, well, it's 100, Susan. And I think that's uh, comparing it to the same bag, but in red color, which was, I think, 175. And Michaela said she would be happy uh, with the 100, 100 buy it now. Okay. And here is. Okay. So this is the Squishmallow Stitch. It was going for $20 and up online. And it is their little Disney line, Squishmallow. And let's look for an opening bid of $10 on this one. 10, 10. These cute little ears. Okay, if there is no interest. Oh, you're welcome, Susan. Okay, we've got Debbie. Debbie at 10. Thank you, Debbie. Any interest uh, for 12? Okay. Okay, that's gonna be sold to Debbie. Thank you so much, Debbie. And actually, um, I have uh, your package and Roberta Scott's going out tomorrow and I've got your necklace right here. So yeah, and I have your stuff right here bagged up. So I will add the... Uh, Whatever you purchase tonight, I can throw in there. 
if you want. All right. What else do you want to see? I've got, this is really cute. Um, you're going to get a six pack of lip balm collection in this adorable little box. Um, let's see. You're going to get frosted berry, candy cane, winter mint, coconut aloe, sugar cookie, and almond vanilla. And almond vanilla. Um, and again, these are lip balm collection opening bid of $10. And it looks like uh, this little tab, it'll pull out like a, a drawer. I think it's taped. Yeah, it's taped sealed, but all right. Um, nope, you sure didn't. Uh, we can pull that up here in a second if you like. Okay, anyone for for 10? Moisturizing lip balm. If there is no grabbers on that, we can bring it back. Okay, Roberta Scott at 10. Thank you so much. Um, if we don't have any other bids. We'll just go ahead and call it sold. Okay. Thanks so much, Roberta. Okay. Oh, and then uh, since we had a request from Susan. Okay, so we have the Ray Dunn uh, Fall You All Blanket. Um, this one, we're going to start with an opening bit of 20. This is a 90 inch by 90 inch. 90 by 90. Queen size plush blanket queen size you guys so this will be whether you want to use it while you're on uh covering a queen bed or if you want to um just put it on your couch but and you guys know it's so soft so i had those cute pajamas last week you guys those ones that said good witch and um had the little matching pants mikhail i was like kayla what's we should um I put mine on and it was the softest pajama ever. I was so, so impressed. Oh, thank you, Rebecca. Yeah, I cut them down. Yeah, they were, I didn't like the last shape I did. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, okay, Susan's coming in at 20, Jed at 22, Susan 24. <laughs> Turned myself into a blanket burrito. <laughs> Oh. And just keep in mind, you guys, when I mail it to you, I'm going to take this cardboard display out just so I can save on room when I, when I ship it to you. All right. Okay. If there's no one for 26, we've got Susan at 24. Thank you, Valerie, for letting, for typing out. Okay, let's call it sold. Congratulations, Susan. Thank you so much. That is...
Okay, I got this cute little trinket box. It has a three leaf clover on it. And cute little clasp closure there. It's about the size. And I'm going to look for an opening bid of $8 on this one. It's a pretty cream, cream colored. It has the little clovers around the side. And that's about the size there. If there's no interest, then we can shit it off to Deshad. Uh, what else do I want to show you? I've got this Ray Dunn shower curtain liner. Um, look at how darling it is. It has little pumpkins and it says pumpkin everything. So here is the design. And we're going to start with an opening bid of $12 on this one. Seventy two by seventy two inches. Oh, blue Susan. I will. I'll, I'll send you a text message tomorrow. Yeah, but get, get some rest. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, yeah, get some rest. Okay, if we're going to pass on this one, um, we'll bring it back out. We'll make a little pile of stuff we'll bring back out later. Um, I've got this cute one, um, the Ray Dunn Stainless Steel Tumbler uh, Sweater Weather. And let's see. And here's your little topper. Thing. It has some instructions, cleaning instructions, and let's go with an opening bid of $12. Yeah, we have such an awesome, awesome family here. Thank you, Shirley. Surely with an opening bit of 12, looking for 14. Oh, I'm sorry, Valerie at 12. That was weird. Rotated. <clears throat> yep, I see Valerie at 12, looking for 14. Oh, good night, Roberta. You have a good, thanks for hanging out with us. We'll be back on Sunday. On Sunday. Okay. okay. Um, Shirley, did you want to 14?
sweater weather, she says. Okay, let's go to Valerie. Congratulations to you. Um, I've got, this is a Starbucks tumbler. Look at, um, what do you call it? Where it moves. Roberta, what is that? Um, you know, where it, it, you can see it when you move, it gets bigger and smaller. I don't know what, why I'm tongue tied. Um, here is your topper here. And again, this is Starbucks. It says right here, it's the Starbucks one. And let's look for an opening bid of $10 for the cute little candy canes. I'm not sure on, well, maybe it's right here. If I can see about how this ounce is. Nope. Okay. If there's no takers on this one, reticulating. Yeah, you can like. Okay. We'll pass on that one. Uh, I have got. I don't know if I want to show you guys. Still got this cute little mouse. Has a little slip pocket in there. The hardware has a little scratching on it. Um, I was watching a YouTube video where they were polishing up some hardware on purses. I'm going to order some of that stuff because I feel like it can really make a difference. You have adjustable strap here. And with that being with the little scratches on it, which again, I feel like can get polished up. But if someone wants to take this from me for $20, um, it has a little pocket on the back, a little button pocket. If someone wants to steal this for 20 bucks, you ain't gonna. That is a promise. <laughs> peppermint. <laughs> she says peppermint. So that is available. I have. Um, I got the Ray Dunn Sun Please with the yellow inside. And if somebody wants to take this for a buy it now of $10, first person to type 10, and it is yours. All right. Okay, Liz. Oh, okay, Liz. I'll put you down for that. Oh, and Liz, you might want to refresh your screen. You might, I think you might be lagging. Just to double check. This would probably be a good time, you guys. Um, just refresh your screens. Just make sure you're not lagging and then switching back from uh, top chat to live chat. Um, how much do they hold? Good question, Fran. Um they don't put any ounces on here. The only thing I can really give you is a measurement, uh, but they're five inches tall with three and a half uh, inch diameter. And then, and 
five inches tall there. That's about all I can give you on that. It's, I mean, it holds a nice big cup of coffee, I'd say. Um, I'll thank you, Patrick. Um, oh, Patrick, you're so sweet. <laughs> you're so sweet. I wish. I wish. Okay, so that one's available. Um, I have the... The other Squishmallow here. This little guy is the five inch uh, octopus, and he was showing for $15 and up online. And so I am going to start him at uh, $10, opening bid of $10. <clears throat> I love the little glitter, and his little legs are like the little glitter fabric. Hi, Fran. Hi, Melody. Good to see you. Okay, if we're going to pass on the little guy, um, again, let me know if you come in and you want to see something again. Um, have that uh, Cuisinart tomato, cut tomatoes fresh um, container. And if someone wants to snag this for a buy it now of dollars first person to type eight and it's yours and it's cute it has like the if you can see on top there the cute little green stem oh rebecca go give him a big hug um okay so roberta said most ray duns will hold about 12 ounces thank you for that hi kim um, no, we only did um, we only did a couple purses. So we're gonna be doing some more here. Okay, so if anybody likes the Cuisinart, uh, that that's eight. And then I still have the cute Santa um, with the dish sponge holder. And I'm gonna do um, a buy it now of eight dollars on this one. So eight and eight on those. Um, have the extra large on the, these are not ramen noodles, not, but they are ramen noodle boxers. <laughs> and the extra large fits a 40 to 42 inch. And we'll do opening bid of $10 on this one. All right, Liz, I'll put you down for Santa. Thank you. Really cute. You're actually... See it. Show you guys what they look like. I haven't even checked. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That is hilarious. It's a nice little stretchy in the band. For the ramen noodle lovers. Um, I just have the ramen noodle one and then I've got these other ones I'm gonna show you guys. Let's put Liz's name on that one. Okay. I have the Coca-Cola boxers, you guys. And let's go ahead. We're going to look for an opening bid of $10. Um, we're going to start with... <laughs> 
I thought Eddie, I swear I thought I was going to read him saying that he wanted me to model them. So that was better that he said. Okay, so this is going to be a size large. The size large will fit a 36 to 38 inch waist. Look at how cool these are. Has a Coke logo. <laughs> no, that's totally, um, totally fine, Patrick. <laughs> I love it. Really cool design, too. Okay, we got Valerie at 10. Anyone for 12, then we're going to do this size um, extra large next. Okay, I think it's just Valerie. Thank you so much. Appreciate your bid. Um, I know, uh, Renee, me too, me too. Okay, so now we have the extra large uh, opening bid of 10. And this, the extra large will fit a 40 to 42 inch waist. Nice little stretch here in the band. Extra large. Oh, then he's going to love these. And Eddie uh, has volunteered to model them for you guys. <laughs> oh. All right. We've got Linda for an opening bit of 10. Do we have anyone for 12 uh, before I call it sold to her? Hey, we're not seeing anyone else. Then let's call it sold to Linda. I don't know where this at. I haven't seen her. Okay, so I got this bear. I'm gonna put this in your Vera bag. Okay. Hey. Um, this one is going here. Um, I still have spring. Uh oh. <laughs> you want to ask him his size first? You want to ask Eddie his size first? <laughs> spring. Buy it now, $10, first person to type it. Um, it is yours. Oh, and I have the, I have the um, Ding Dongs. <laughs> and these are a size boxers. Opening bid of $10 um, on this pair. The large fits a 35. 36 inch waist. <laughs> okay, I've got Valerie at 10. <laughs> okay, was there anyone for 12? <laughs> I write Patrick. <laughs> Okay, um, let's call it to Valerie. Thank you, Valerie. I'll never forget that time that um, Ro bought those boxers and then when he was on the, the live lounge uh, show, he stood up and showed us the boxers. I about died. 
I about died. Um, so I'll show you. Okay, so I showed the Michael Kors bag. And again, if you guys rewind, um, uh, if this bag interests you, um, I showed it earlier. This is the big one with the lock um, design with the little key. There's a little hole right here. And it's a big, it's the big one. They do make this style, but a shorter one. So do keep that in mind. Um, and what did I write down? This bag is going for a hundred to hundred and twenty-five dollars and up online. Um, what did I offer this one at? I think I think 65. We're gonna do buy this is a buy it now of 65 bucks. Again, it's going for over a hundred dollars online. It's in freaking fantastic condition. Amazing condition. Um you guys ready for this bag? Oh my gosh. Oh, CC. All right, CC. Boom, bada bang. Got a fantastic, fantastic deal. Love it. Okay. Um, I am so in love with this bag, you guys. I was doing um, some research on this. Look at how awesome this bag is. So you guys are more than welcome to look it up too. I looked it up. It's sold out. I couldn't find any for sale. Now I just scrolled and looked at a few places, but everywhere it was sold out. I think there was maybe one on eBay and it's $150. Now I'm not, I'm going to uh, definitely discount it for you guys. There is a few, see the little dots, a few of these missing, but they're real standard colors. It's the gold, blue, silver, pink, and red. Um, you know, I'll offer it for a great price. Oh, not a bid. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, CC. Oh, oh, was so, oh, you were answering. See, I just catch you guys. I just catch you. I'm like, hey, guys, do you remember the price? And I'm like, oh, sold to CC. <laughs> sold. No. So the Michael Kors bag is still available. My bad. <laughs> um, okay, so, again, you would be just buying this as is. Overall fantastic it's just a few of these missing so if it doesn't sell i'm probably just gonna fix it up and uh, look at the condition that it is gorgeous Huge bag zipper compartment slip pockets um let me show you the zipper look at that bag oh my god so being it's a hundred and fifty dollars online, if he wants to steal this bag for a hundred bucks, you can take it. As long as you know that some of those little things are missing. But yeah, it's this bag is sold out. Um, every I'd find some for sale, but I clicked the link and it said sold. I went on another one, sold, sold, sold everywhere. So yeah, I was like, if it's, if it doesn't sell, I will, um, I'm going to fix up the little sequence. But you can't tell me that's not a cool bag. Isn't it awesome? Um, still have the uh, pink Jessica Simpson bag. It has the long uh, detachable straps or you can use the handles there's like lots of compartments button one zipper compartment another button compartment here and this bag uh, was looking for $35 That's a steal for these Jessica Simpson bags. And it looks to be in like brand new condition. 
I think it's better without the strap, in my, my opinion, but. And it is like a blush pink color. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but there is that cutie. Uh, and still have that cute little coach. Uh, buy it now. I'll do $22. Well, it's a uh, black in color. Then, yeah, I still have this cool fall sign. It's a wooden little plaque here. It's a pretty decent size. If someone wanted to steal this from me for $12, you guys can take it. You guys can take it. Um, okay, here's a Kate Spade bag. I just got this in today. Awesome condition. Has a nice pocket, deep pocket here. Inside, it has two zip pockets and a zipper compartment. Inside, the lining needs a little cleaning up, but the outside is great. Now, I know I wrote it down here. Yeah, the, uh, this, you know, Kate Spice, I already know. These bags, these bags are going for $150 and up online. This is another one that I'll do on this one. I, do, I can't go any lower than that. I try and offer it to you guys first and then whatever, if they don't sell, Michaela throws them up on Poshmark and she does raise the price. <laughs> try and give it to you guys for the cheapest, but, but yeah, great, great condition. So that's available. And then I have one more Kate Spade. This is like a briefcase style. Hi, Christy. Um, lots of little compartments right here. And then inside here, it's more for a laptop or uh, a laptop or whatever else you want to use. But it has the um, soft cushion protector for your, for your electronics. And these were going for a dollars um, and up online. And I would do a buy it now on this one. I'll do a buy it now of 75. And that's Kate Spade. Has the long adjustable strap and a zipper closure there. Great. This was a fun lot of purses that came in today. You can see that. Um, okay. Yep, yeah, 75. Thank you. Um, Michaela has this one, um, but they're she's gonna sell it for super cheap because. It's like in good condition overall here, but then right here it has these weird little, you can see it right there. So it's, you're buying it as is. Um, I think Michaela said she would, has a zipper compartment, slip pocket. Um, I think she said we were gonna start this on an auction. We'll start it at 20 bucks, $20 which is going to be super low for a Michael Kors, but you're buying it as is, as you can see those little flaws there. So, yep, if anybody wants to... I even had some wallets too that might have matched that.
Yes. Yeah, because we did have a Michael Kors a wallet too that could have went nice with this. Okay, and if there is no interest in that one, we'll shut it off to the side. Okay. Moving right along. Okay, first let's do this one. This is a Ray Dunn stash. Um, has little Q-tips in there. Cute little jar with the lid. And you can use whatever you want in it. All right, Liz, thank you. Okay, I'm going to put her name in it real quick. Um, let's start with an opening bid of $10 on this one. Yeah, you don't have to use it for the Q-tips if you don't want. You can put like your change in it, maybe in your room or whatever you want to use it for. Okay, CC at 10. Thank you, CC. That's about the height there. Kind of love this, uh, the brown color. Kind of reminds me of like, like the doctor office style, like jars they would have. I thought it was kind of cool. Okay, I see Liz coming in at 12. And it came with the Q-tips. I was kind of surprised. I didn't know they do that because it is, it's sealed. All right. Okay, CC's at 14. All right, thank you, Liz, for typing out. Um, oh, Patrick, I love you. You're the best. CC, congratulations. You guys are the best. <laughs> I'm going to end up invoicing CC and she's going to be like, what the heck? I didn't get that purse. <laughs> oh, my bad. My bad. Um, all right. Next. Okay. Here they are. Um, these are not frosted flakes, but they are pajama pants. Um, extra large fits. So pay attention to this inches. Extra large will fit a 35 to 47 inch waist. So it has the draw, uh, drawstring. I went online. I searched everywhere. I cannot find these for sale online. I even went to the uh, swag website and they don't, they don't have these. They have the socks, but they don't have the pants. So I think I'm the only one that has them. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I couldn't find them. So these, you guys, we will be starting these at an opening bit of 20, 35 to 47 inch waist. Here's what they look like. Let me see. I don't know if this is sealed. Oh, it's not sealed. It's not sealed. So let's, I'm going to show you what they look like. Let's look at them together. Oh, these are so cute. And you guys, they are so stinking soft. Look at, they are super soft. So it has the drawstring here. Oh, that's super cute. Oh, there's Ryan. Ryan. Ryan's going to uh, model them for us, too. <laughs> Durable. Thank you. Yep, if there's no one for 22, then we're going to call it two. Two card shop. Oh. 
I mean, their packaging is the coolest, too. <laughs> All right. Because they're great. <laughs> so cheesy. Okay, they're going to you. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Next up, I've got these um, cool cups here. It says, Rolling with my Nomies. And you're going to get a set of six of these. Going to start with an opening bid of $10. Um, I'm going to give you, I don't know why they don't do the ounces on these. But it is six and a half inches tall. The diameter in the cup is three and a half inches uh, wide there. But yeah, you can see about how tall it is. Rolling with my Nobis, reusable plastic cups here. Let's see. Dishwasher safe. Um, that's really all it says. Cute, cute cups though. Okay, is we have Valerie for an opening bit of 10. Oh, Dawn, you put six. Did I think I thought I said ten? Didn't I say ten? Okay, we'll just roll with it. It's okay. We'll just we got Liz at eight, so it's totally fine. Liz at eight, looking for ten. No, it's it's okay. We'll just roll with it now. It's no big deal at all. But they're adorable. Oh, no apology, Dawn. Don't you, you don't have to ever apologize, girl. Okay. Okay, Valerie's at 10. Um, Liz, we'll see if she wants to stay in for 12. Otherwise, we'll call it, we'll call it showed. Okay, she is out. Liz at 12. Thank you so much, guys. Appreciate your bids. <laughs> okay. Um, I still have the two Bath and Body Works candles. Um like the, it's like the Christmas tree smell um, and they're the three three wick candles it just doesn't have the glass but most of you guys have extras of those hopefully um, so I'm gonna do if someone wants to snag both of these for a buy it now of $18 first person to type 18 and they are yours and again they are Bath and Body Works uh, candles Love that smell. Oh, you're so welcome. Okay, so those are available if anybody wants to snag those. Um, I have this little cutie. Let's see if I wrote down what I looked up. Um, don't think, but that's okay. I'm going to look for an opening bid of $10. This is like the longer one. So some of these were scented for some reason. I feel like this one was, I thought it was supposed to be marshmallow. I don't know. Maybe you can look it up online, but it's the longer, uh, little bodied one. 
Yes, you were gone. I was like, card shop is, he's busy. No, I, I, I think you said you're really busy. Okay, anyone for an opening bid of $10? That's a little pink bow. Okay, and if there, if we're gonna pass on that one. Okay, and Roberta. All right, Roberta. Great to see you, Liz. I uh, hope to see you back on Sunday. Have a great weekend. Okay. Um, let's call it sold. Thank you so much, Birdie Bert. Sold to Birdie Bert. Um, what else should I show you guys? Got, still got this cool, I'm, no one bought this, right? Last time, Roberta? I didn't put a sticker on it. I don't think no one got it. Um, so this is uh, the Cool Skull uh, Aromatherapy Diffuser. And it's LED lights too, guys. So it changes to seven different colors. And it's also going to come with the cinnamon oil. But you can always do your own essential oils if you don't like the one that's in there. But look at how cool it lights up. And this one, um, if someone wants to buy it, I think we were doing a buy it now. I'm going to do a buy it now of 22. That way we're not, we won't do an auction. If someone wants it, you, you'll have to snag it. I just think it's cool that it changes colors and you can use your own little oils. And it says that it has a quiet fan that circulates the aroma. Oh, that's cool too. So yeah, really neat little, little guy there. Otherwise, we're going to just have to put him away and maybe we'll bring him out uh, next year. We'll bring him back next year. Um couple other things to show you yes. Hi, Diane. Good to see you. Okay, so we have the flying pig, <laughs> Squishmallow. Look at his little tail and his mohawk. Um, let's see, the small flying pig. This little five-inch uh, guy was online for $22. Crazy. Um, I am going to do an opening bid of $12. $12 starting bid, five inches. He's got his little iridescent wings. Yes, they're just so soft. Disco skull, yep. <laughs> Dawn, I was going to send you this TikTok of these cutest little pigs. And I'd be like, how can you eat these little things? Okay, we'll bring, we'll bring these back out on Sunday. We'll bring them back out. Okay, I have a Ray Dunn cotton ball, uh, and it is sealed. Yep, it did come with uh, the cotton balls. has a nice little wooden uh, lid there. And we're going to start with an opening bid of 10. No, oh, I eat tur I don't eat any pork. Um, but I will eat turkey bacon. Speaking of turkey bacon, I'm going to make me a BLT after this auction is over. KCC, thank you so much. Ray Dunn.
It is. It, I'm telling you, if you eat turkey bacon, you'll love it. You'll be just fine not eating those little piggies. Um, oh, yeah. I, I love BLTs. Those are like my jam. Okay. Let's call it sold to CC. I'm not seeing any other takers. Thank you so much, CC. <laughs> flying, yeah, flying turkey bacon sandwich, Dawn. Cutest candle ever. I am so in love. Look at the little Santa candle. It's really not so little. Um, he is standing. And I had a cute idea for him. He is five inches tall by four inches. So um, if you have like a candelabra or one of those candle stands, I thought this would be so cute on there. Um, I don't really have a Christmassy one, but like, let's just ignore that this is a pineapple. Imagine it's something Christmassy. And then you put the Santa on it. Oh my goodness. So uh, let's start. Um, I'm gonna look for an opening bid of ten dollars and he's heavy. He's he's a big a big boy. Um oh I love it, Ryan. That's awesome. Love hearing that. That is the best. Um oh jet it. I'm going to be honest, I get my turkey bacon from uh, Walmart because they don't have a lot of, uh, it's not Oscar Mayer. That one I don't like. It's, um, you can see what, I'll, I'll check it and I'll send you a picture. Uh, but let me tell you, it is so good. I cook my turkey bacon in the frying pan and then I pour my egg whites and stuff over it and I throw in some little cut up cherry tomatoes and some asparagus and I just mix it all together and it's, and I put uh, Valentina hot sauce. That's how I have to eat my eggs. <laughs> They're so good. Okay. Franny, Fran, Fran. Thank you, Diane. And I, I, I promise I'm going to get your, uh, your little invoice together. I pro I'm going to work on it this weekend. Um, yeah. Yeah. So CC knows. Okay, I'm calling it sold to Fran. Thanks. Thank you so much. He's so cute. Put Fran's name on it. Okay. I've got this cute little bag. This one's Michaela's. Um, you guys will probably know the brand. I'll probably butcher the name of it. Let's see. It is the Tig Tignam la 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 la. <laughs> here, I'm gonna hold the hold it up here. You guys can see it. T I G N A N E L L O. Tignanello. Tignanello. <laughs> really cute uh, bag. It comes with a um, detachable strap. Um, or you can just carry it like this. And inside it has this little uh, clasp to pull in the sides of it. And I like that. Um, it has a magnetic clasp. It's actually a super strong um, clasp on there. And inside, a nice size. It has little slip pockets. has a little zipper compartment. And we're going to start this one at an opening bid of 18 and how do I know? Because Michaela wrote it right there. 
because <laughs> it's her little cute bag. It is black in color too. And great condition. Honestly, I, we think it was brand new because um, the strap was still like wrapped up and it looks to be, it looks to be an unused <laughs> condition. A cute little little one okay and if there's no takers it's right here and oh and I still have these two guys if anyone wants to snag these this was the corona boxer shorts extra large fits 40 I'm um, 38 to 40 inches and if someone wants to snag it real quick, buy it now, $10. It is yours. And that's what they look like. All right. Thanks, Kim. Okay, let me put your name in it. All right, you are welcome. Okay, so that one's available. And this is the cutest thing. I am so loving this. I actually picked this up today. Um, look at this cutest little ceramic pumpkin. Now, I thought, maybe was it a candle? But I think, I was trying to read the tag. I mean, I guess you can do whatever you want with it. But maybe, but, um, um, hand-painted, crafted with love. Um, I guess you could maybe put this like uh, sugar in it for like your coffee or tea station or something, but it's darling. I'm going to look for an opening bid of $10 on this one. If, if Dee was here right now, I know that she would be trying to get this pumpkin. <laughs> She likes pumpkins too, like me. And if there's no interest in this one. Oh, did you? Oh, that's weird. It it didn't. Oh, you well, I saw you type it. Okay. Oh, so you are if you're for sure wanting it? Sweet. Thank you, card shop. I'll put you down for it. Okay. Actually, I think I'm going to end up taking this little pumpkin downstairs. It's so cute. Okay, let me put Ryan's name on this. You guys have seen, if I don't put a sticker on your stuff, I will end up reselling it the next day. I am. Okay. Perfect. That is yours. What else do I have? Um... Okay, first let's show you this. Um, really cool gift. This is a Game Boy mug. It's the heat change. How freaking cool is that? So here's what it looks like. Cold up top, and that's what it looks like hot. Is that the neatest thing ever? We are going to look for an opening bid... Of, we're going to start with an opening bid of $12.
Mm -hmm. Oh, no, thanks, card shop. It's no problem at all. <laughs> Roberta, fill with your enemies here. <laughs> oh, voodoo doll. Okay, we got jetted at 12. Yeah, that, this was a fun find. Too bad it doesn't, doesn't play noise, you know, <laughs> when it's uh, heated up. Or it goes do 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 do. Okay, Melody at fourteen. Looking for sixteen. Janet. Did, did I do okay? Did it kind of sound like it? <laughs> I played that game so much as a kid that it's like embedded. Okay. Melody 14. We'll see if Jedid or Shirley want to hang in there or are they out? Okay. Jedid is out. Thank you, Jedid. Okay, I think maybe maybe Shirley's out. <laughs> oh, Shirley is not out. Shirley is in for 16. I'll give Melody, see if she wants to hang in for 18. And then coming up, <laughs> I have this coolest acorn decor piece. Um, I loved it so much that I actually have two of them because um, I, I had to have one. <laughs> oh, I loved Frogger. God, I, I was so addicted to that Frogger game. I can literally like transport to when I was a kid. I can remember. I used to remember waking up and all I wanted to do was play Donkey Kong and Frogger. It was like those are my two faves. <laughs> Today I do, Roberta. All right. Shirley, are you thinking, honey? You think you think maybe 20 or oh, and Tetris too. That was so fun. Yeah, I remember my brother got Atari. And he would get so mad because my mom would be like, you let your sister play. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right, Shirley's coming in for 20. Thank you, Shirley. Okay, Melody is out. Oh, did they, friend? Yeah, you know, those were the days. Those were the days. Congratulations to Shirley. I think I still have a box here. Not. Let's start one over here. Okay, so yes, I got myself one of these. I think this is the cutest thing ever, and I put it in my living room, and I just love it. What a fantastic, uh, just the detail. I'm was so obsessed with it. Um, let's just give you a quick height on it. It's eight inches tall. It's an eight by six. And I'm going to look for an opening bid on this one of 15. Oh, Maria's back. Oh, that was a short little nappy. Oh, and Space Invaders too. Yeah, Jedit. I love Space. Well, I love Miss Pac-Man too. Loved uh, Miss Pac-Man. I couldn't do that slow Pac-Man. was like, womp, womp, womp. 
I, I love the uh, super one. Is that what it was called? Where they go faster? Okay. Any, any interest? I mean, look at how cute that looks. That would look so cute on your, whether on like your dining table, like with a centerpiece or something or in your living room. Okay. Okay. If there is no interest, I'm going to set it right here so you have to stare at it. <laughs> Okay, let's see what else I have for you. Um, I don't know if I brought these to you guys yet. I, maybe I did. I can't remember. But I have the Reese's uh, men's sock. And, you know, women can wear these too. Size 9 to 12. And look at what they look like. You're going to get two pairs. You're going to get two pairs of socks. So we're going to look for an opening bid of $10. see oh cool it's not sealed up top so let me show you oh that's so cool you have this pair and this pair who doesn't love Reese's <laughs> I know candy corn I was looking Jetta I couldn't find any yeah Cindy you could use this as like a dress. <laughs> Cindy could use this as a dress or a snuggie. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hi, Allison. But it's the packaging that gets me to. I think it's awesome. Someone got this as a gift. You are CC. Okay, um, if there's no one for 12, I'm just going to call it sold to Allison. And hi, Allison, how are you? Okay, it's sold to you. Thank you again. And then I still have, this is so adorable. I'm surprised. Maybe, maybe someone else second time around. Um, I've got the Ray Dunn shower curtain. And it's a 72 by 72. It says it's a, a like a, as a liner, but I think you could just use this and put a liner behind this one because this, look at the pattern. It's adorable. And it says, um, the saying on it is pumpkin everything. Pumpkin everything. Um, so we'll just do um, opening bid. I don't remember what we did last time. Let's just do opening bid of $12. Ray Adun. See, I totally would have kept this, but my uh, guest bathroom doesn't have a shower in it because otherwise I would have decorated that. But so I had to pass. Oh, good, Allison. Love it. And you're welcome. Okay, so that's still available. I know that. Uh, People email me after the auction. So if you're contemplating, don't wait too long. Um, and then we scored a bunch of these, the baklavas, uh, walnut. And so tonight with your guys' purchase, um, you're going to be getting probably two. They're individually wrapped. And so um, I'm going to probably put two in everyone's box. So if you like baklava, even if you don't, I think you're going to like it. Um, they were pretty tasty. They were. Um, I have this cute little Ray Dunn 
Um, oh, Ray Dunn. Vera, I've been saying Ray Dunn. Uh, look at this cute little backpack. And inside, it has uh, three slip pockets and a little coin purse. Look at that little added bonus. You know, maybe this is actually, I think this would be like for jewelry. Maybe you slide your rings on there or something. I don't know. What do you guys, what are your thoughts? So you're going to get this and the bag and let's look for an opening bid of $12. <laughs> oh, meal motivated, I'm telling you. And I, I just got everything from the store yesterday um, to make the copycat Olive Garden soup. Um, Roberta knows the name of it. What's the name of that one? Oh, it is so good. I try, I make it like once a year. So I can, I am making that tomorrow and I, my mouth's already watering thinking about it. Oh, well, let's see. Oh, there's a little side pocket, little zipper compartment there too. Cute. Cute. I love the little, uh, the pattern on this and that. Okay. Pasta Fajoli. Is that, am I pronouncing that right? Oh, it is so good. Yeah, you guys can Google um, the copy, just copycat Olive Garden. And they have some amazing uh, recipes on there. Okay, let's call it to jet it. Thanks so much, jet it. Fazul, Fazul. Okay, you will know. <laughs> you know how to pronounce it. Um, yeah, it's amazing. Um, but if you do got, if you guys do try and make it, um, if you you can buy big bottles of Valentina hot sauce from Walmart. It's only like a couple bucks. This giant bottle lasts me for like months, and. That was the game changer for the soup. I put some of the Valentina in my own bowl. I didn't put it in the whole pot because Michaela might not like all that spice. Um, but man, if you put Valentina in that soup, uh, you will thank me. You will thank me later. It's amazing. Hey, what else do we want to see? All right. Someone's got to take this. Look at how adorable. It's this beautiful uh, gray, um, like velvety material. And we're going to do an opening bid. Let's do an opening bid of $12. I mean, these are, these are kind of like all the craze. They're, um, I keep seeing these everywhere. <laughs> I know. Valentina should as much as I put it in everything. I put it in my breakfast, my lunch, and my dinner. Everything I eat is pretty much Valentina. Oh, frugal. Oh, bummer. That's okay. Glad you came in. So yeah, it's a pretty big size and it's, you know, cushioned. And it's like a weighted bottom so that um it sits balanced out nicely and if no one takes it i'm probably gonna end up keeping it because i'm loving it and i like the little pl little plastic stem on it all right passing passing okay now i'm gonna let that sit there and then i've got um so we have the cute acorn. No one's the pastor. No one took it. But I have the wooden pumpkin. This thing is solid. So it it's, has some nice weight to it. But it is such a cool piece. Um, and we're going to start with an opening bid on this one of 
15. <laughs> yes, you do, CC. <laughs> yep, she got uh, Roberta's, uh, that pumpkin lady. Really neat design. I don't know, I'm all into this stuff right now. Because remember, I had those little turkeys I was selling, the wooden ones. So I've just been um, accenting uh, things in my house with this wooden look. Do, do, do. They were made in India. Okay, I'm going to set these here. Um... I did have uh, someone, uh, Smiley Mama. She was in the precious moments. I had a couple of other ones. I had this cute little ballerina. Look how darling. It says, Lord, keep me on my toes. And if somebody wants the ballerina for a buy it now of $12, First person types 12 and it's yours. Oh, I think you're probably, you might be lagging, Allison. Um, yeah, no, she she definitely puts the price after after I say it. Um, hi, Southern Gal Jen. <laughs> Jet it, you could. Like it's a weapon. It's a whole weapon. So yeah, if anyone is into any of the little precious moments, I have a few of those. Um, I have this cute little brown coach. This one is Michaela's. If someone wants this one for a buy it now of 25, steal it. it. Has this nice little velvet material. Inside it does have a couple compartments. One compartment here, another compartment. Oh, there's Glamas. Glamas, I just want to give you the biggest hug. So nice to see you. You know what? We've been thinking about you. Okay. Let's put your name on it. Yes, yeah, so awesome to see you. Um, okay. For the men out there, or a great gift for your man, I've got these awesome, uh, the men's cabin socks. These are a large to extra large. So it says it fits a size 11 to size 13. These are the original Muck Lux. Um, slip resistant and warm and cozy lining. So it has the little slip resistant grips and you guys, I mean, these are so warm. Let's start with an opening bid of $10. I love the red, the, the plaid, red and black. Very, very soft. And again, it's the original Muck Luck. Um, okay, thank you, Jedit. All right, Jedit in at 10. Anyone for 12? Okay, it looks like Southern Gal Jen's coming back at 12. And a size 11 to 13. This 
super soft. Okay, let's see if Janet wants to hang in there. Do, 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 do. Okay. I don't think. Is Janet? He's out. Thank you, Janet. All right, we're going to call it sold then. Congratulations, Southern Gal Jan. Yeah, and again, for those of you that are in here, um, no auction tomorrow, but we will be back on Sunday, uh, 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. I've got a whole uh, room of new stuff that I have. Um, that you haven't seen yet. So uh, you guys will be, don't miss Sunday. Um, oh, Glamma, that's so sweet. Thank you. Um, oh, we love you so much too. It was, it's so good to see you, to see you back around. Again, we definitely, we've been thinking about you. Thank you again for that. That was so sweet. Oh, do you, Cindy? Oh, wow. Yeah, it's a fun little brand. Um, uh, what else? Um, I have this guy. Look at him. So, researching this one, he is Charlie the Terrier. Charlie the Terrier. This guy is online going for forty-two dollars and up. Forty-two dollars. Um, if somebody wants to snag him for a buy it now of 30, first person to type 30 and it's yours. That's the big one. <laughs> Black eye, she says. <laughs> oh, Dawn, you're so funny. Yes, Charlie, Charlie the Terrier. He's so cute. And then I do have the other octopus. So these, this octopus was online for $40 and up. Look at their cute little legs. 40 bucks and up. I will do a buy it now of, let's do buy it now of 28. Twenty eight on that one. Um, is there anything else I want to show you? Oh, I wish Glamis would have seen this purse. She loves Coach, so she could appreciate. But yeah, this was the score of. So excited to get this bag. Um, I won't repeat myself because you guys can rewind. Um and see some of the stuff that was passed on. Um, this bag is pretty much sold out everywhere. I looked and I clicked on tons of links. It said sold, sold, sold. Um, found one for 150, um, maybe on eBay. Uh, it's in fantastic condition inside. Lots of little slip pockets. Um, the only thing was, is there's a couple little gold ones missing. Um, the nice thing is they're pretty standard colors. Uh, gold, blue, white, or silver, pink, and red. Um, so I'm either going to fix it and then put it on Poshmark for over 100 but I was offering it to you guys for $50 less than I saw it online, um, and we're doing a buy it now of 100 on this. And it's amazing condition other than the little, than the little sequence there. But, yeah, great. The handles are in amazing condition. So that one, again, if it doesn't get sold, I'm going to just fix it. Um, oh, let me show you guys this. I'll probably just end up bringing it back out on Sunday. But check out the score I got. Oh, 
look at this thing. It just came in the mail the other day. So this is um, this reproduction in wood of the Jicara del Agula, commonly known as Aztec calendar or sunstone. Now look at on the back, it has this thing, but it was written up here and it says Cancun, uh, January 28th through February 3rd, 1986. 1986, it was selling for 32,000 pesos. It says $72 in 1986. I've been seeing these online. I, I saw one that was 400 and then I saw others that were in the hundreds. But look, you can see how nice and thick it is. And there's the little story on it. But look at how big this is. What a cool thing. Um, I was just going to sell it for uh, a buy it now of $90. And if you can get way more for it, I don't care. Have at it. Super neat. I'll have to figure out how to mail this to someone. <laughs> Yeah, but again, in 1986, it sold for 72 bucks, so over 30 years old. So uh, I just know someone's going to email me about that. So that was a cool one that I got in today or yesterday. That one. Um, still have this cute little penguin trinket. Thing. If someone wants this for a buy it now of $6, uh, first person to type six, um, put your little jewelry on there. Another stocking stuffer. Still have this cute one too. The welcome family and friends, little wood hanging a uh, little decor piece. If someone wants to snag this for a buy it now of $8, first person to type eight. Thank you so much, Jen. Appreciate you. Just so you can see about how things up. So there is that. Um, so at this Michael Kors, so gives me the Chanel vibes. Has the little tassel um, inside, little zipper compartment and a slip pocket. I had drastically reduced the price because the lining had come apart right here with some maybe fabric tape that could easily be fixed up. Um, that was the only thing. Um, you know, these bags are like over a hundred bucks. Um, but if someone wants to steal this one and you want to fix that little piece right there, uh, I'll do a buy it now. I'll do a buy it now of $35 on this one. Here's your little adjuster right there. Darling little bag. Um, have a Kenneth Cole little black bag here. Just a simple little one. It has um, a little button pocket and credit card slots, zipper compartments. If someone wants to take this for a buy it now of $10, first person to type 10 and you can have it. And you can have it. Have uh, this Steve Madden bag, two uh, button compartments on the ends here, and then a zipper compartment in the middle. Inside a uh, slip pockets and uh, zipper compartments. Lots of little space. All right. Thanks, Jedit. Um, if someone wanted to steal this one, uh, buy it now of 18 on that. 
overall fantastic condition. $18 for Steve Madden. Have I lost my mind? Okay, Jedit, uh, put that one in your box. Okay, so that little one. Have that Ray Dunn Bark. If someone wants to snag this, buy it now, $10. And I have the Sunday Fun Day. Buy it now, $10. Ray Dunn. Oh, they are cold. They have the window cracked open. I didn't realize it was that cold. Um, okay, so those are here if you guys want them. What else? So I have the big Kate Spade diaper bag. You can use it for an overnight bag too. It has the long stra uh, detachable strap, um, lots of compartments on each side. You know, these bags go for well over $100. Uh, but if someone wanted to snag this, buy it now, 50 bucks, and you can steal this freaking Kate Spade. Kate Spade. Oh, Patrick, you're the best. You're the best. My daughter always gets on me. She's like, mom, stop singing. I always hear you singing and whistling all the time in the house. I'm like, well, it could be worse. Oh, really? You're going to get some snow? I love snow. Okay, so that beauty, again, you can see how big that is. So that's a big shash a bag. Um I got this Michael Kors. This is a big one. This has uh slip pockets, a zipper compartment. Um, the only thing is the handle has some fraying there, but that's the only thing, is just that little handle. Other than that, the bag is freaking awesome. And I was doing a buy it now of $40 on that one. 40 buck. A Rooney's. Really nice like that. I don't know what to call this fabric. I don't know what to call it, but it's really soft. So there is that one. So I have this cute little Kate Spade crossbody, three compartments in here. Has the adjuster right there. Someone wants to snag this one for a buy it now of 35. Could probably flip it for uh in the for double the price of that. That's for sure. Okay, okay. I have this little Vera. Has the little slip credit card. And little slip pockets, zipper compartment. Someone wants to buy this for a buy it now of $10. First person type 10 and you can have it. <laughs> okay, Patrick, it's a deal. It's a deal. <laughs> I will sing with you. <laughs> yeah, I make up lots of songs too, what they all... Um, have my dog's names incorporated with it. So if I hear a song on the radio, Michaela will catch me singing it. But I put in the dog's names. <laughs> I am such a dork. If my daughter ever filmed me and showed you guys, 
You guys would hysterically uh, make fun of me. You guys would make fun of me. Um, okay, so Roberta gave me the permission to lower the price on these. Um, these are Roberta. She sent me those uh, the Halloween Barbies. Um, this one is the Halloween Charm. And these are uh, from, I'm pretty sure I remember it was maybe 2006. Online, they're selling for $25 and up each. Um, I am going to drop it. If somebody wants to take any of these for a buy it now, I'll do a buy it now of $16. $16 on either one. So you have the Halloween Charm and Halloween Star. Never been taken out of the box. Oh, you can't sing. That's okay. Either can I. <laughs> I can't sing either. Uh, trust me, you can ask my daughter. <laughs> so, yeah. So those. If anyone wants them or email me. Um, la, 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 la. That might be all that that might be all I'm gonna show you guys tonight. Um yeah, and then no one took the sun, please. That was by it now 10. Um had this Starbucks one. This, you know, people go crazy about these tumblers. I don't know, I never got into it. This was the gold one. Um, I found this one online for 35 bucks. But if someone wants to steal this from me for a buy it now, I'll do a buy it now of $12. If you guys, someone wants to take it. I had that one and then the Starbucks peppermint one. So if you anyone wants to steal either one of those, let me know. Okay, I think I think that's all I was going to show you guys tonight. The gold, it's yours, girl. It's yours. Thanks, Roberta. No, I don't think I have anything else penguin. I actually, uh, I had the penguin beanie baby, which was interesting. Um, and our friend, it's me, Angie, she bought that one. Yeah, but I'm sure I'll have more to come in the coming weeks uh, for the holidays. So come back and check. Oh, and I'll keep an eye out for you. Okay, so yeah, if you guys see anything that was passed and you're interested, send me a message and we'll be back on Sunday. Um, I've got some awesome stuff, stuff that is not here on the shelves you haven't seen. Um, I've got some other handbags and some more Ray Dunn. I got another box of uh, Squishmallows, um, some holiday stuff. So uh, yeah, come back and check it out. I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend. Um, posted a dumpster dive video on the Heather's Halls. So go and peek that one. And then I'll have another new video coming out. I'm gonna try and shoot for Monday. Um, 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Uh, Mountain Standard Time, Jen. Yeah. Um, oh, does she, Jen? That's cute. That's cute. Well, I'll definitely keep an eye out. Um, yeah, and thanks for hanging out with us, uh, Card Shop. Uh, Ryan and Patrick, appreciate you guys. Jet it. And uh, thanks to the mods. Appreciate all of you always hanging out with me. Um, CC. Oh, thanks, CC. Cindy and uh, Joanne. 
uh, you guys and Allison, thank you so much. Love all of you. And we'll see you on Sunday. Have a great rest of your night. Bye guys.